All right, we're back in Colombia again with uh, this DC-3, similar to the one that crashed five days ago in Colombia. This one is April 13th, 2022. You can see stalled there and goes into the trees. This is a picture up close of kind of what happened. Thank you, Jose, for these pictures. And then this is the aircraft. There was the Policia Nacional of Colombia. And you can see the conversion turboprop, uh, Basler BT-67 with the Pratt & Whitney PT-6A-65 uh, engines. And now those propellers are destroyed. Um, there were uh, 14 or more souls on board. Um, all survived with various uh, injuries. But it happened at this La Vanguardia airport. You can see the tree line here to the left. So the ended up somewhere along this side of the runway. And then here is some pieces of the aircraft. And then here it is from a different angle into those trees. Please subscribe if you want more of this type of content so you don't miss further news. You can see our firefighters are on scene. Um, no fire or f uh, fuel spills that we can see, but there are these police possibly on board and um, they're going to treat everyone medically here and try to get them to the hospital per usual. But you can see they got their proximity suits on and they went ahead and made access um, through these doors here. Here's the tail number. But again, with all the people on board, uh, glad that nobody was injured. And if you missed yesterday's tragic video um, from Idaho, there was a crash there. A woman pilot sadly did not make it. You can watch it here. If not, please subscribe. This is Arfordam Keone, and I'll see you guys next time.